time for Better Bites, and today Rhiannon and our food dude Kevin Roberts are making life easier with some ideas for the leftovers. Take a look. That's right, Audra, and Kevin here actually just opened a new restaurant. So that makes a uh, 50? 75, <laughs> uh, I think three. Okay. Uh, but uh, Southern California, mm -hmm. San Diego, North County. It's called Escondido in the Westfield Mall. Okay. So we are open. Get a little bowling get and food bowl on. Get a little bowling, get your food on, or more importantly, let's get our leftovers yeah, on. Yeah, because we always have leftovers, and we never know what to do with them. Rhiannon, I'm full. Yeah, the family yeah. got a left. baby there. <laughs> <laughs> I'm my first trimester. Uh, okay. So the family's gone. We have leftovers. So yes. apparently we have, everybody overcooks stuffing. We have apparently about four pounds of stuffing left. Right. Couple uh, tricks though. Stuffed mushrooms. Ooh. So easy, right? Yeah. You throw I them right, never right in the that. oven. That's you it. You see the beauty over there? It's wow. easy, easy. That is easy. Or what about just some stuffed pork chops? So mm -hmm. you take the stuffing, you, you basically butterfly the pork chop like that, and you stuff it in there. Could you do chicken too? Oh, absolutely. Chicken, absolutely. Okay, like that would that. be very tasty. And then you, then you uh, bake that off. Oh. Stuffed pork chops, super yeah. simple, right? Okay, so what about, uh, we have a little bit of corned beef yeah, hash? Yeah, if you got some extra corned beef or roast beef or you did some ham, you had the big ham hawk out, you could just do a ham hash, which is basically green peppers, you know, onion sauteed with it. It's basically like your breakfast hash. Ooh, I your like Your simple that breakfast one. hash, but you just, you add your protein to it. Now, we have a special treat. Kevin is actually gonna share with us his meatloaf recipe. This is one of them. I've got a All few, right. but basically obviously start with some ground meat. I like doing ground turkey too, or if you wanna get exotic, ground buffalo. Ooh. That's hot right now, ground buffalo, no uh, saturated fat, very lean, but basically you add some tomato sauce, right? You mm -hmm. add some eggs, right? Use this, that's the glue. The glue that holds it right? all together. Yes, a little Worcestershire sauce. You like that little kind of smoky flavor. I'm mm -hmm. not gonna add I much. say Worcestershire. I say wussy. <laughs> wussy sauce. Wussy sauce. I like that. Um, a little salt and pepper. Here's another trick too, if you want if you want to add a, a little beer to it. Ooh. A dark, a nice dark or robust beer. Not if it's for the kids. Give, give it a nice little flavor profile. Actually, the, the, the alcohol cooks off from beer. You oh, know okay. that when you cook it. Oh, so there's I actually didn't. no alcohol, it's all flavor. So you're actually getting the hops of the flavor. So okay. you Mix that all up. You can make it into a lot. <laughs> work it, Rihanna. Delicious. Work it. Then I, I, you know, you could add some crunchy uh, uh, French French fried onions here if you want mm -hmm. to give it a little kind of a crunchy taste, or you can use it to top the meatloaf with. Just but give it a little texture. Put it in a baking pan. You bake it off. That's what happens. Here's the end all result. Right. So now you now you have basically food all week. Mm -hmm. This like, I love coming home after a long day and, and not having to cook again. Yeah, yes. but, but but making like a meatloaf sandwich or a meatloaf Ooh, melt. So let's okay. let's cut a little piece. Now there are you go. what are you mayonnaise mustard ketchup? Uh, definitely. What, what mustard. kind of What about spi you know my cayenne ketchup? Look how easy this is. Okay. Cayenne ketchup. Ooh. Hot sauce. And ketchup. I am not a and big of course, fan you know, of ketchup, I use a but French look, bread, look huh? at this! Look at this! <gasps> look at that! Money! Woo! Throw that right on there. Okay. And I'm sorry, did you say mustard or mayonnaise? Yes, mayo. I okay. mean mustard. Mustard. Okay. We'll throw a little mustard on there. Right, so nice little meatloaf sandwich. You throw some pickles on there, and then throw some cheese on there. Throw it in the oven, Ooh. or you just do a melt. Okay. Oh, money, we call that. That's that money where I come from. Delicious. I love it. Great recipe, as always. Things to do with all of our leftovers. There you go. Okay, we know you have a couple of books out there. Kissing in the Kitchen. 75. <laughs> 75 restaurants Two. and books. No. Okay. So then find them all in your books as well. Yeah. And on our website, bettertv.com. Audra. Thanks a lot, Rihanna. And Kevin, I could have told you, Rihanna does not like the ketchup. Leave it alone. So if you want to try any of Kevin's recipes featured on Better, just go to bettertv.com and then click on the videos tab.